Ladies and gentlemen, today is all about glowing up. Part one of glowing up, we got, we got pills to make me the most healthiest man possible. Don't harp on me too much about this, but I do shave the armpits. I know there ain't much here, but I gotta get rid of it. Ladies and gentle brothers, to the next part of this uh, little glow up day, I'm gonna give myself a quick little haircut. I've not gotten myself a haircut in a very long time. I've mentioned this so many times before, but with this whole series going on, I've just forgotten about stuff. I've just forgotten about like how fast we're actually like, or like how fast my life is moving. Like everything's been going for me. What is this, 48th, 49th episode of Project 50 now? Something like that? It feels like yesterday when I just started this series. Like bro, we're already half, like if I'm in school, like we're already halfway through like the second semester time's always the winner time's always the winner i don't even know what date it is half the time what is it like the fourth of march right now it's kind of perfect timing too since like my hair kind of looks kind of trash right now so but one little lesson i wanted to give to you guys just a little bit no matter what i feel like you should definitely take like some time of like the month or like let's say like a couple times a month where you just genuinely just focus on like I've been focusing on myself this past 50 days but like all I'm saying is like pick a certain day where like you genuinely just like work on you like the way that I'm doing right now so you know if you're watching this video make sure to do something that like improves your I don't know quality of life I guess or like you know confidence or something like that it's an important thing to have I've been kind of like self-reflecting the past like few days or something and what I realized is that a lot of my issues specifically just for me would definitely be solved if I just like hone in on that confidence you don't understand how much confidence can really help with like a lot of stuff a lot of aspects in your life when it comes to dealing with situation when it comes to dealing with stressful situations you know talking to people all that kind of stuff relationships it's like a lot of it does get resolve by just being confident because having that self-confidence within yourself it'll make you feel like you can literally do whatever you want as long as you don't do it wrong there's definitely a fine line between confidence and ego and uh you know i would like to teeter behind that line i think having a certain amount of ego is a good thing but like if you get too lost in the sauce you'll get too egotistical and that's not a that's not a good thing to have ladies and gentlemen so yeah let's all get our confidence up today boys all right if you watched the end of yesterday's episode this is a clue of it all right Ooh, all that i need is you Is a belt of D5. I mean, she. We're definitely on. Oh, let me let me get a better view of it. My freaking glasses are in the. Like I said, we're definitely on our awkward stages when it comes to the perm. Uh, this is kind of like the last bit of the perm that I have left. And um, after a couple of haircuts, it's, it's definitely gone. Mmm, all right. Fire, 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 fire. The move right now, actually, is something a little different. So, you know, Taz, we're looking to get. Uh, a harness for him because as I mentioned before and you guys have probably seen he's the one that like really tugs on you when you when you walk him and especially when he sees another person or a dog specifically a dog it's like it's only when he sees another dog he gets really like tuggy on the leash so we figured that we didn't want him to choke himself out uh, MMA style so we're gonna get him a harness because I think that's the best idea mm. I saw the fire in your eyes Bitch, you tell me things you wanna try You risk it all to feel alive, oh yeah You said you do this all the time Ooh, we hit notes better now What who the fuck is this? I can tell you that's not Hazino, bro Toyota be wildin', bro That one day was a violation, personally I wouldn't have it I'm no one else You ready for the joke? I can feel it coming in the air. It's in the air. Let me cook. Oh. Another one of me won't come around again. <laughs> yeah. Do I look like Harry from Sidemen? This next song, I will hit it 100%. Oh, 
<laughs> nah, probably not, mate. I'll just do the first part. I'll stick to that. Talking about the technicalities of it, um, I think that go. I think that like the peak of it. I think that goes to a G sharp five or a G five. That genuinely the highest note that I can go. That is the farthest note that I can go. My voice is back, so let's blow it out today. Pause. Girl, come and get it. All this is here for you. I'm just cleaning out the little cubby right here, bro. I still have the pass from the hotel that I stayed in. I still also have the money order from like months ago, bro. So one of the coworkers wanted to keep Taz for a little bit. I'm not sure if I mentioned it earlier, but they wanted to take care of Taz for a little bit and we decided to go get some get some supplies for him there's another part of the glow up this i, I kind of do this every day so it's not like it's so it's not like it's anything serious but gym time we only got a little bit of time left it's uh, by the time i get there it'll probably be around seven i did kind of skip the lifting stuff to do some uh some boxing training uh throughout the week i definitely need to catch up a little bit i don't want to lose the muscle okay it is actually kind of weird how short my hair is I usually have my hair longer but no today our hair is quite short am i wrong to say that it makes me look a little more manly so i only have a little bit of time for the, the crunch gym before i have to go to the other gym but yeah i'm gonna try to get a couple rounds in this week hopefully if not then uh then then we move i'll definitely try i'll definitely try and i'll record it for you guys oh boy what am i now what am i now what if i'm someone you won't talk about kills me cause i know we've run out of things we can say i get the feeling that you never need me To say the least, I dislike this song with a passion. Ladies and gentlemen, it is absolutely busy today. Oh god. Hey, I got a decent parking spot though. Hey, dubs in the chat! Part one of the fitness section of this video done completely. I'm now gonna be training after this and uh, after that. That's pretty much it for the fitness section. And we got a couple more things going on, but you know, we'll save that until it gets there. You know, part of the whole glowing up spiel is like, look good, feel good, all right? And you know, we did the first part of looking good. Now, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling really good. Uh, got some training in. Also got that pull day earlier, so really good day overall. I will say that my lip is a little bit wonky right now because uh, we were doing some body shot sparring in this uh, this new guy. I did three rounds with him and uh, you know, I could tell that you know he has uh, scrapped before. He's much younger than me, but I feel like he's definitely got experience when it comes to like sparring with like, let's say his brothers or his friends or whatever. Like he, he moves like he does have a little bit of experience, but I can't fault him on it, but uh, he was one of those people that like, that threw really hard and stuff like that and he caught me in a lip once as being a new guy obviously you don't know your power like that but this might have been a little bit immature but you know when he when he when he threw really hard i had to you know like calm him down in a way that like i can only know how i, I kind of wailed on him a little bit because i was my main my main thing was like i was just working on technique and like trying to figure out like openings stuff like that and eventually throw a couple shots in there but just throwing a lot of just haymakers and stuff and, and i was just thinking in my head like bro relax i kind of rushed him a little bit i was just kind of playing patient most of the time but i was rushing in a little bit caught him with a couple of good ones and he calmed down a little bit and he started going off again and i'm like bro yo like not trying to kill you take it easy a little bit which fair play to the guy man he was still like trying his best and you know he was already really gassed like i could already tell like he was he was out of it so fair play to him for you know actually like pushing through and being a dog good work on him man good work on him looking forward to more man here we go there's a I can feel it come Never wanna be one come around no again Ever Ever I'm really gonna miss That was so sus, I am sorry Although we had me the first What's wrong? Got that champion's meal Uh, protein Went to the mall and got me a burrito Yes Yes, a little chorizo burrito, very nice. I also got some creatine, so feeling good, looking good, feeling good because I got some good food. Ladies and gentlemen, the next part of this uh, glow up, or the last part, is shower. I feel clean, I feel good, I look good. It's 
it's just a good day, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's been my day of glow up. Just a normal day, but I just wanted to take this day to really work on just this. I mean, and this, of course. So if this inspired you to work on yourself too, I'm very happy about that. You go, man. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, smash that like button. Subscribe. Yeah, bigger, you